What is up guys, Digital VFX here again and I'm going to be teaching you how to make a number of effective buildups in FL Studio and this is like my fourth or fifth time trying this video and it always ends up being too long. So without further ado, I'll get into it and try to do this as fast as I can. So uh, there's a number of type, types of buildups that I use. First type is called a tom build, so you're going to bring the tom into piano roll. Start off on any notes you want. And I'm just going to do a quarter note. Actually, I think it's an eighth note. Copy that. Paste it up there. Do the exact same thing two more times. And then you get this effect. Alright, so then you get that, so we'll paste that in there, pattern 1. Alright, so then we're going to go to pattern 2, and the next thing is called a doubling kick. So you're going to go to pattern 2, you're going to do kick at 4, and obviously I'm not paying attention to the samples. I'm just worrying about the basic sounds. And then you're going to go to pattern 3, you're going to make a kick every 2. Put that in there. Oops, the snap's not on, so make that exact. Alright, so then you're going to go to pattern 4, go and make kick every step and then go to send a piano roll click on there um what you're gonna do is since snap is off you are going to get your razor tool you're gonna cut a note in half then you're gonna go to the to the uh, paint tool you're gonna click on one of them make sure that the quarter note is selected just so you will paste more of that and then you paste that in the timeline it'll sound like this and that is a little bit off so I'm going to try to fix that alright let's try that sounds a little bit better so now what we're gonna do is we're gonna do pattern 5 I'm gonna add 3 OSC and do this uh, really fast just gonna make a uh, six measure um, build and uh, you can check this out in my dead mouse video on how to do this um, just gonna make a simple uh, wave sound which is a white noise from 3 OSC and it sounds like this And another thing I like to do is in citrus, I like to use citrus for this be because it has a really sensitive uh, volume, or not volume, pitch knob. So I'll just select a uh, one, one that sounds alright. So then I'm going to go to piano roll, go to pattern 6. And I'll set snap to main, put the pencil. We should make that have it. I'm gonna kind of do the same thing that I did for the uh, the um, kick. I'm gonna double it, so I do. I'll do this. Then I'll do there, and then I'll do um. Excuse me. All right. So So now what you're going to do is you are going to add that and you are going to go into Citrus, create an automation clip for the uh pitch. 
and do something like that. And it'll sound like this. Oops. Sorry, I need to uh, make that cut off like that. Alright, so that's pretty much a bunch of build-ups I use. Um, I'll try to uh, see if there's a... Uh, that's not it. Um, I think I have it in this song. Wait for it to load. There's so many plugins that I put in here. Uh, yeah, right here. I'll close some of the programs I have. Always seems to uh, not cooperate whenever I record. really crappy sound I don't know why but I don't really care I guess it doesn't really matter I showed you how to do it in the tutorial before this so uh, I hope this helped and this video was kind of rushed I wish I could spend a little bit more time on it but uh, I'm really tired and uh, I've just been behind on videos and uh, this has not really been my priority lately so this video was kind of rushed. I hope it helped for uh, the effect you're trying to do. If it didn't, just comment, rate, subscribe, comment down, and uh, tell me to stop being such a lazy person and go make a better video. But uh, this has been a Digital VFX production, and thanks for watching.